Hey guys, so in the last video, we spoke about initial two components that you require in your resume to turn your resume into super powerful action oriented resume, which converts into interviews. In this video, I'm going to talk to you about the remaining two components. So third that you require in your resume is an offer. Yes, what do I mean by that is typically when you send your resume to somebody, what people do, they'll write that here is my enclosed resume, uh, this covers this, 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 I look forward to hear from you. Trust me guys, stop writing, look forward to hear from you or look forward to hearing from you. People are not keen to get back to you until unless you have something really significant to add value to the profile or to their organization. Start giving people an offer, an offer which can push them, direct them and guide them to take next steps. What do I mean by that is when you are sending your resume, try doing this. Here is my enclosed resume. This covers this, 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 this. I completely understand that this two page resume might not give you 100% about my profile. I would really appreciate if we could get on to a 10 minutes call wherein I'll tell you more about my organize my uh, profile. I'll understand a little more about your organization and I can possibly demonstrate how I can add value to this profile. So always trigger people to the next steps that you are expecting by sending your resume. Fourth thing, which is very, very important guys. Typically, if you are applying on multiple job portals, you have applied on hundreds of jobs, but you are not even getting interview calls. One critical reason could be you don't have right keywords in your resume. What do I mean by that is every organization, every job portal these days is using application tracking system. What it does apart from a lot of other things, application tracking system searches keywords in your resume and tries to match it with the profile. If it matches, your resume gets to the next level to be reviewed by a physical person. Otherwise, your resume gets rejected at system level itself. There are research which states that 60 to 70% of resumes get rejected at system level itself. So if you're not getting calls, one of the core reasons could be you don't have right keywords in your resume. So guys, if you really want to expedite your job search results, I would urge you to enroll for my job hunting workshop. It's a comprehensive five days online step by step video based workshop. It has been, you know, enrolled by 400 plus job seekers over the last 10 weeks. And we have multiple success studies around this job hunting workshop. But I don't want you to do it blindly because I'm not looking for people who are looking for instant gratification. I'm looking for people who are ready to learn, who are committed to take actions and who are committed to, you know, implementation strategies that I teach in the workshop. So first step is you register for my live masterclass. Check out what is there in the workshop. I'll share with you the three secrets to transform your job search in this masterclass. Go through those secrets. If you can implement them by yourself, there is nothing better than that. But if you really need guidance, support and handholding through this workshop, after the masterclass, you can enroll for it. So I will see you in the masterclass. Thank you.